All right, we restarted the stream. We're good. We're good. All right, welcome. Welcome in. <laughs> I, I'm so sorry, Thorbury. Welcome in. Wow. <laughs> All right. Anyway, welcome. Yeah, so um, the big big load of text is the riddle for tomorrow's game. Um, that's all that is. I did it as a little test. I'll be spamming it. Um, yeah. Hey Dave, long time this year. How are you doing, Philbury? I hope you're doing well. How was, uh, you were doing some coding last time I spoke to you, right? You're, you're, you're planning out a, a bot that's gonna be a better than all of the MeSeek bots and everything. I'm interested, please. I would love to hear about it. But I hope you're doing well. Hey Boogie, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I don't know why I said J Boogie. It's you two have like even your nameplates are different colours. Bubbery developed the J Boogie bot. Oh my god. It's like the episode of SpongeBob where they make the SpongeBob robot. This is it. I tried to make a joke because of the restarting stream. Oh hey Dave Long Time this is sorry I got you, I got you. Yes, we didn't we didn't just call Flawberry J Boogie accidentally, that didn't happen. That didn't happen. For the VOD's sake I might even have to cut that. <laughs> I'm very embarrassed and very sorry both of you. Right, I'm gonna stop the Halloween music loop TM. How are we doing? If I can manage to host it correctly, it's pretty much finished. That's amazing. Hell yeah. Well, please keep me posted or keep us posted in the Discord. I'd love to hear about it. You got me stumped on the riddle again. Oh, really? Okay, I think my word, I will say I also did this while I was at work, so I'm very sorry if it doesn't make sense to people. Uh, I will read it out. I'm going to read it out in its entirety. Um, This is a game I plan on playing as like a one-off but if people really like it and it gets a lot of like a lot of people saying they want to see more of it i might even make it a series um going into november so we'll wait and see um let's i'll read it in a sec when i went to sleep early yesterday and now the stream streak is gone oh i'm sorry dude <laughs> i'm sorry we'll bring it back that i'll um how does it look um Chat, I've forgotten. There's like a way it looks. Um, no, I, I can't imitate that. I, I don't think I can do that in, in Twitch. Oh well. It's an in in spirit, Flawbry. I'll take it in spirit. It's all good. <laughs> it's all good. All right. Okay. The riddle is lycanthropy isn't for these. Uh, sorry, sorry. I'm ruining it already. Lycanthropy isn't for everyone, but especially not these two. As there's another kind of transformation the owner would go through. He has no cravings for humans, pets, cheese or meat. It's only prized veggies that this hulking mammal would see as a formidable feast. That last bit's a bit long. In hindsight I might trim that, but it's all good. But it's a it's a game. Um, I, will, I, I think if I give it any other hints, it's going to give it away immediately. Is it a game about a pig? Sadly not. Sadly not. But anyway, okay. Well, for today's game, however, is going to be a little game called Nightmare Cart, which for anyone who doesn't know, is a... I believe it's made by one person, but do not quote me. I was going off of the Steam comments for this. Um... Nightmare Kart is a Mario Kart-esque kart racer um, themed around the campaign of Bloodborne. I'm not even joking. Um, so this is basically Bloodborne... I, I don't know if people remember, but ages ago we streamed Bloodborne demake, or the Bloodborne demake. It's a uh, non-infringement kart is the best way of putting it, J-Boogie. Yeah, it is non-infringement kart. Um... But it has a campaign, and it says that you can beat the campaign in about two hours, so I'm going to try and do that today. So this is making up for the fact I'm probably never going to play Bloodborne. We're, we're going to do it like this on stream in cart racer form. 
So enjoy. I can't remember where, but uh, I oh hang on, it says controller not supported. Wait for nightmare cart. Okay. Sorry, I can't remember where, but I played a game once about some were pig that had a vegetable farm. That sounds insane, but I kind of love it. <laughs> that sounds really fun, actually. A were pig. That sounds like a D and D like side. You know, you get like books of D and D, which are like side campaigns and like side things. It gives it gives that kind of vibe. Hell yeah. Look at this. This looks so fucking good. Controller does work. What are they talking about? So this is Nightmare Cart. This is called already. Honestly, if anyone hasn't played the Bloodborne Demake, I don't think that's available on Steam, but the Bloodborne Demake, I highly, highly recommend you go check it out. I it's the only Bloodborne I've played. Caleb, welcome in. How you doing, dude? Speaking of Bloodborne, have you played the scene Bloodborne PSX? I have. We, I, funnily enough, we played that on stream in 2022, I think, Caleb. Um, we played it a while back, but I, I really enjoyed it. That's the closest I've gotten to actually playing it. So, some of these enemies are like Persona enemies. That thing right there looks like a Persona character. I've heard about this game. I didn't recognise it, but a friend's uh, sent me the trailer once. Yeah, so I think it's free on Steam. Do not quote me on that. I was able to get it on Steam for free. Um, so go have a look. It's called Nightmare Card. If you were curious. But yeah. Anyway, we're going to play the campaign today. Hopefully it's something I can beat in a sitting, but we'll wait and see. The dream watch has noticed your presence. The dream watchers don't seem concerned with your reasoning, uh, reasonings as to why you are visiting the city of. Oh God, Mirolodia, Mirolodia. I, as you can tell, I've definitely played this franchise in game. Mirolodia, Mirolodia. The dream watchers want you to sign a contract. Seems harmless. Okay. I give up on the riddle as well. It's uh we'll get there when we get there, guys. We'll we'll, we'll do it, I promise. Okay. Oh. Okay, we're good. Fine, we're gonna go with. I'm probably closest to that, but we'll go with the weird gruff. Mm. Yeah, we'll go with gruff, gruff lad. Why not? Nah, fuck it. We're gonna go with the other one. There you go. Is it a pen that the feather's holding? Like a contract pen? I can't tell. Okay, the dream watchers offer you mysterious keys. Choose one. Oh, hunter cart, or oh, hunter motorcycle. Oh, I, I kind of like. I'm not a motorbike guy. I kind of like cars more. And even then, I don't like cars. So I feel like I'm always gonna go cart. I'm talking about a Mario Kart, by the way. Um. Yeah, IRL. I'm really not good with cars. I couldn't tell you anything. Um. Fine. Right, let's go with the car. You begin to feel drowsy. Oh no. Is everything coming through and sounding okay, by the way? Sounds good so far. Perfect, thank you. And so, the nightmare begins again. <laughs> and that's why Dave 
me and David to put up canc the cancelling and late public transport, literally. Oh god. Okay, so A to accelerate. Okay, this is cool. Boost consumes ether vials, okay. Sure. Yeah. It looks like it could be louder on the volume mixer. Ah, it's like that, okay. Sure. Okay, so drifting generates more aethers. Cool, that's neat. I like that. They thought this game through. Hell yeah. Also, the soundtrack pops. Holy shit. Okay. Ranger, I hope you're doing well, dude. Caleb, is, if I didn't say it as well, I hope you're doing well. Hope everyone's had a good Tuesday. Wow, this is literally Mario Kart. <laughs> there are two lawsuits being written right now. And we get items as well, of course we do. I don't know what that one just did, but it did... It did something. We get a gun? I think we get a gun. <laughs> wow, we just... we got a gun then. Mario Kart with guns, let's go. Okay, so it's good for me to be killing things. Okay. Okay. Oh. We just got struck by lightning, what the fuck? The hunter awakes. A misty dream, surrounded by a host of peculiar characters. Ah, uh, yes, it is maid person? Question mark. And wolf potentially. Okay, pocket dream circuit is the next map. Save. Sure, we're gonna do a save. Okay, let's continue. This game is very cool. I really like this. It's really neat. Uh -huh. You must be the new participant. I am Herman, and this is Onet, my animated servant who tends to my every need. You must be confused, but try not to think too hard about all this. Just go out and win a few races, and it'll all be over before you know it. <laughs> I'm going to turn it up in a sec as well. So we're being forced to do races now. Cool. This is our life now. Pocket Dream Circuit. <laughs> The Smash Bros. announcer is here. Did you know? Doing air tricks will generate eighth of. Okay, cool. We know this. Oh, 
Fuck, okay. Fuck. We're doing fine. Fuck, okay. You know what, when we're actually in game, it doesn't seem too bad. Can I snipe them from this far away? I actually don't know. The music has no right being this good. Right, we've got to catch up. We've got to catch up. Is a fucking Gatling gun, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, so do we, never mind. Damn, I did terrible. I did absolutely terrible. Alright, we can do better. We can do better. We can do better. Okay, I'm gonna quickly turn the game up while we have a little gap. That looks a bit better. Alright, it's fine. It's all good. Alright, we got this, we got this. It'll be easy this time, right? Aha! You must be the new participant. Here we go. Alright, we got this. I gotta believe. We are nearly dead though. I'm a bit concerned by that. better about this round. Music seems fitting, I don't right. Oh 
Oh wow, okay, you just fucking die, that's cool. Good, I'm glad that happened. I just fucking died. Actually can't believe it. Well, we're not doing it now, that's for sure. Fucking hell. I'm so annoyed, I can't believe we died. Okay, I got like, hit by a billion things at the beginning. I blame that on that. Can't believe it. Actually can't believe it, I'm heartbroken. Oh, we can continue? Okay. After learning the rules of the road, the hunter embarks on their journey through the city of Mirolodia. We're gonna go with that. Mirolodia, Mirolodia. In search of answers, a fellow outsider one who claims to have vast knowledge of the cursed city and its inhabitants beckons uh, through the hazy pane of a dimly lit window and warns that the hunt is on tonight and that the first race is soon to begin. Okay. Got the melee weapon, excuse me. Preemptively, please be warned that I'm gonna. Absolutely suck. We're gonna get the sword to go, why not? Right, let's save with the sword. This game is interesting, it's so it's so funky. It came out this year as well. It was was it early this year? I think it was early this year. The other one definitely came out in twenty twenty. <laughs> Ooh, it definitely said Miralodia as well. Brack Brack. It's a Poochie. It Poochie. Oh, we've, got, we've got some other fellas here as well now. Big rat fellas, my kin. Okay, we're doing okay. Back to Dave's restless driving. The man that cannot drive is driving. Fuck it, hell. The music, it, it slaps so much, oh my god. The music is heckin' good. What did I hit? Oh yeah, we are like miles ahead. Wowie zowie. Good. Right? I think we're all good.
But yeah, this game has no reason to be this good, you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> like don't get me wrong, like, it's all the power of the solar developers were like, this is insanely good. It's at the kind of point of polish for me where I'm like, if somebody from, like, I don't know, Bandai Namco turned around and said, oh yeah, so, some like pro like promotional content for Bloodborne being ported or something, or a Bloodborne show coming out or whatever. Here is, a, here is like a fun little flowback game to go with it, you know what I mean? It feels like that kind of thing. But I love it, it's really cool. It's really cool. With their first taste of a victory, the hunter sets their sights on the Miralodia underground and descends into the grimy abyss. I started reading that like it was going to rhyme. Fuck, I skipped a bunch of dialogue. I think I'm okay. Uh, ooh, what do we have? Rusty... I think we'll keep the sword. I'm pretty happy with that. Oh yeah. Alright, let's do it. Miralodian Sewer Arena. <laughs> I love the Super Smash Bros. announcer, dude. Team. Beat the enemy ten times to win. Okay. There's like a team... team agenda. Alright, well there we are. a bit of like one of those Mario Kart like alt modes, you know what I mean? Alright, I need an item. I actually really like this, this is really fun. Sir? From the same team? Sir? Sir? Oh. We win. Oh, we did seven. So we got the most kills. We got seven kills. Hell yeah. We're meant to get ten, right? But I guess it's the first two ten as opposed to land directly on ten. Oh, this looks cool. I have no knowledge of Bloodborne, by the way, so I have no idea where we're at. The hunter emerges from their uh, scrape in the cesspit uh, and steals into the angel graveyard. 
grounds lo- uh, sorry uh, yeah grounds located on the city outskirts named after great beings of worship there in the shadow of uh, Mirolodia's towering visage they encounter a blood spattered uh, hunter atop a roaring motorcycle they mercilessly father sorry the merciless father Grigori bears his hunter axe and launches into battle damn okay as in father is it father Gregory it's probably father Gregory in that it's not gonna be like in half-life it's not gonna be father Grigori <laughs> it's just a dude from half-life with an axe in the Raven home he's just chilling up there he's waiting he's just waiting Oh. The snarls of filthy beasts. Beasts who must be hunted. Beasts who must be slaughtered. It's only a matter of time until you become one. <laughs> right, okay. Look at him. Look at this cool motherfucker. <laughs> Gotta catch him, ah fuck. Again. Oh shit. Um defeat him, ah oh, fuck. Ah oh, fuck, okay. They stuck over there. They might have been stuck in a corner. I get him? Oh shit. You got him good. Hell yeah. Oh no. Oh no, don't tell me there's a phase two. Oh god damn it. And he's got a fucking machine gun. What the fuck is this franchise? Uh 
Can I not go up here? Hello. Shit. I just gotta drive by it and pray. Fuck. We're also not in the best for ourselves, so I'm a little bit worried. Right, one more of those, we should be all good. Maybe two more. Oh, we did it! Kill them. Hell yeah. This is really cool, I like this as like a way of redoing like Dark Souls combat. It's like Mario Kart again, it's kind of fun. It's kind of, it's a really unique, like a unique way of doing it. I've never seen it done like this before. That's pretty cool. There's got to be a game where there's like a battle system and a karting game, right? There's got to be a thing. Having bested Father Gregory. The hunter becomes privy to a shred of insight. Their newfound knowledge illuminates the path forward. The truth of this nightmare and the means to escape it lies in the old clock tower just beyond a fetid den of slithering serpents, a forbidden forest. Listen, as long as it's not the forbidden forest with spiders in it, I'm fine. But that being said, isn't there... I'm pretty sure there's like, isn't there like spoders in Dark Souls? Uh, in not Dark Souls in Bloodborne. Give the motorcycle, but a go. But I feel like I kind of like the handling of what we've got now. Big old spider. Old spiders. I don't. I, I feel like... Nah, let's, let's keep using what we're using. I'm kind of... I'm one for sort of sticking to my, my guns and... Some aspects with these, so... I'm okay with that. Big ol' spoiler. Well, I'm going to pray that we don't have to race. Imagine if there's a little spider sitting in a Mario Kart, like, go-kart. I'd hate that. I genuinely hate that. I love that there's, like, a motorized wheelchair and stuff for one of the characters. Oh fuck, I didn't. Oh my god. KY, welcome in. Pretty shit, Bloodborne car. You're winning the I'm doing alright. I'm in sixth, but. Fuck. Fuck. I was saying this before, this is the closest I'm gonna get to actually playing Bloodborne. So I'm gonna try and savor it. <laughs> So 
but okay, I'm fine, I'm fine. We'll be alright, we'll be alright. From that to our room first, see? Just like that. So I have like no no like prior information about who is who in Bloodborne. So I'm like so lost. Probably certain references and characters are that is completely going over my head. Where am I going? Where am I going? Where am I going? I'm going over there. But yeah, this is a really competent kart racer, honestly. I actually really, really think it's cool. I like the music, but again... <laughs> part of me is like, if this was playing during like a Bloodborne playthrough, I don't think I'd be able to take it, <laughs> take it seriously. No. <laughs> I know it's the wrong way. Did it to me again, I can't believe it. It actually did it to me. Okay. Well. It's ruined, the, the run is ruined. Alright, we're doing great, we're doing great. KY, how is um how is UFO fifty? Is it good? I had it on in the background after I came back from work and you were playing what looked like a Splatoon esque game, but you were like a, a car. And you had to try and like outdo the enemy team's like paint thing. Get fucked. Oh my god, we nearly didn't make that, but we did it just at the end. Oh my god. Oh. That was stressful. I like held my breath for the last bit because I was like, fuck it hell. Alright, we did it. We're doing good. We're doing good. Let me catch up with chat. UFO 50 is incredible. Game of the year uh, easily. Hell yeah. Heard great things. Yeah, no, same, J Boogie. Night Mario Kart, literally. Jessica, welcome in Hayden. This looks like one of the those fake old games. It kind of is. Kind of is. It came out this year, and it's Bloodborne themed. Oh, lost in the uh in the uh, blah, blah, lost deep in the forest, the hunter aimlessly roams. In their fear, they make a dreadful uh revelation. The serpents have started to speak. Or. Or oh. yeah, the game's called Paint Chaser. Ch Chaser, Chaser. It's okay. You give it a six out of ten. Fair. fair, fair, fair. The other times I've been lurking. There's like one game that I keep seeing you go back to, and it's like you're playing as like a girl, and there's like a bunch of like slime things that look like they're from. Uh, they're not from Dragon Quest, but they're not far off. They're like a mixture of that and Bubble Bobble or whatever it's called. There's like one game I keep seeing you go back to every time I've like lurked whenever you've been playing it. But yeah, UFO 50 looks neat. I think I need to check it out.
Oh yeah, there's nothing wrong with it, Jessica. I, I honestly, like, this and the Bloodborne demake were genuinely incredible. I think they're they're really, really cool. I'm, I'm very, very, like... I, I'm amazed that they exist, to be honest with you, based on, like, the fact it's kind of, like, an IP they're yeah, you're, you're inking. But I think I'm just so used to Nintendo shutting down every single fan game in existence that I keep forgetting that actually some companies aren't awful about it so yeah it's funny snake ball classic character listen classic dark <laughs> dark souls character snake sorry not dark souls bloodborne character yeah the i i'm a big fan of a good demake and yeah the bloodborne demake from what i played <gasps> i'm to mo listen if there's anything you need to know about me, I love a good silly car, and I love me a moped. Anything that looks remotely like Mr. Bean's car, or is a moped, or a three-wheeler, that's a Dave-mobile. None of this sports car shit, we need, we need the Dave-mobile. Watch us do complete shit now that we've changed to it as well. I can't wait. It's going to make things even... What's this? Odd. Uh oh A lonely hunter lost in the woods. <gasps> I like the little snake with the hat. The old clock tower, are you? <laughs> lost little hunter. I love his little hat. Look at him. Rummaging around that decrepit old tower will only upset her. Oh, yes. And we will. You wouldn't be able to have any fun with you if you go off and get killed by her now, would we? How about a little game? Defeat the three of us, and we'll show you the way. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Forbidden Forest Arena. <laughs> I love how jarring the music and the Smash Bros. announcer are. It's so funny. Grab the inside and return to base five times to win. Okay. I love the weird pig bear thing. That's kind of fun. Yeah, voice acting's not terrible. Oh, lit. Let's fucking go. Uh oh. We died. We were that shit. Oh my god. We died immediately. What? What's going on? I don't know what happened there. We were just permanently reversing. I, keep, I hate this. Okay. Oh fuck, you don't have it. Fuck. Okay, we need to find a way over there. <laughs> wow, I love that. I love... Okay, this, this one is a bit yikes. I kind of hate this. Like lost shit. All right. All right, we got one. I love the little sidecar we've got. It's great. Oh, come here. 
Why can't I use my gun? Why can't I use it? I don't understand. Real talk, why couldn't I use my gun? You guys saw that, right? I had a gun. Fuck's sake, right? Right, mine. No? Not, not mine? Game? I'm mad. I'm genuinely furious. What happened there? What genuinely happened? Why could why couldn't we pick it up? Why were we not able to use the gun? What happened? It does give PSX. Uh, yeah, anime RPG. I do get that. I'm not going mad though, right? Like I had a gun equipped and everything then. Fucking get in this. Little sidecar fella, you hear me? Oh, fuck. I mean, fucking don't. Except they're probably going to get that one. That's fine. Drink. AI seems more competent this time. No. I just feel like I'm not able to do anything half the time. My least favorite one so far. I don't enjoy this. I don't understand how it's jumped from like zero to fifty. That's or like it's not quite a hundred. It's just it's like, oh. <laughs> if anyone says get good, you're getting banned. <laughs> no, I'm joking. It's fine. Right. Okay. We still have it. Oh my god, I wish it told me. I need I need a big glowing thing to tell me when I've lost my insight. I'm blind, I can't see. So why is it 3v1? I don't understand. Oh? Fuck. 
I, I can't. I'm losing my mind. Somewhere? What happened? Why is it over here again? Ugh. I hate that you immediately lose it if it's been shot. You should you should drop it when you die. Not not the other way. That's so stupid. No. No. Good. Alright. Fine. Make it. Oh, I did it. I won. Fuck. Okay. I'm now terrified. do it. I don't understand. Did that count as a win? Oh, I see it's sudden death for who can get not a tie. But didn't we get it? I'm pretty sure we did it, didn't we? I'm not going mad. Didn't we do it after the fact? Is it because I was holding on to one? Didn't count, did it? It didn't count. That's so annoying. I know that there's an effort to give the game, uh, the game a plot. Yeah, no, I, I think it's cool. I'm, I'm honestly like, still a, a bit blown away at how good this is. <laughs> Just to be clear, I'm getting angry at this one particular game mode. Conceptually, I think this is a great idea. I really, I really hate this <laughs> in particular. It was, just, it was being really finicky about like. How you had to like capture things. And... Yeah, I don't know. I think we're doing okay. <gasps> no way. Where did it go? I, I don't know why there's three of them. I genuinely... I, I'm tilted. I'm, I'm not mad. Why is there only one of me? 
Before we stick, we have an item, sorry, my bad. I, I, I don't know what to do. I, ge I genuinely do not know what to do. One of them will get it, and the other two will bully me. It's actual, it's not fair. I, 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 I don't know what you do. This feels like such a shit. <laughs> I didn't know you could throw it. I'm really annoyed. <laughs> I, do, I just don't think it's balanced. Why is there only one of me? I don't get it. I feel I feel like I'm being a little fucking piss baby by complaining, but why is there three of them and one of me? How is this fair? Is this how it is in the game? Can I have some combat? Is this... This music does not represent how I feel right now either. What? What am I stuck on? Go! For fuck's sake, what are you doing? <laughs> I'm getting so angry at Nightmare Cup. Jesus, I did think I'd be this, this, like, petty over it, but my, my god. I apologise, everyone. Doing pretty good. Hit <laughs> Rick and Morty yeah, again, I know, right? Okay, feeling pretty good about it. I wonder if I just kill them, if they actually respawn or not. Better not catch up, I swear to god. Right, I'm getting this one as Revenge, thank you. <laughs> You're making this a Rick and Morty bit, just kill. Oh jeez, Rick! Why do I look like an eyeball? Morty! <laughs> 
I still, I still very much can't stand. Hey, there we go. My god. All of these achievements are really rare as well. I wonder when people gave up. Like, no, it says like under like 10% have these. Oh no, this is the clip. I'm doing pretty good. The Matilda sisters have been defeated. Uh led the way to the great clock tower, a citadel housing the secrets of the hunter's past. Announced to the hunter, a strangely familiar figure lies in wait. <laughs> Literally KY. I'm an umbilical only Wow, that voice just wasn't... That was Mickey Mouse, that wasn't fucking right. I'm not gonna do that again. Sorry, I'm not doing it again. <laughs> Funniest shit I've ever seen. We're doing pretty good, guys, yeah. That's pretty, that, that sums up most streams, honestly. Oh, it's meant to be like... Oh yeah, so you're right, it's, sorry, I read that. I saw Rick and I thought I was meant to be reading it like Morty. You're 100% right. Giant boar. Let's go. I think we've got to check out what the pig's like. No, oh, I don't know. I kind of like the moped. We'll keep the moped. Let's change over to that. Golden Moped Master is literally. Except in this context, it's race as in like race, car race. <laughs> Based and goaded and red pilled. I like the already placed down cart line. Some knowledge should be left forgotten. Excuse me? Oh, I know very well. The sweet sounds of secrets whispered in your ear. There is only one cure for a hunter as intoxicated as yourself. Good old game of Mario Kart, am I right? It's her booting up her Nintendo Switch. Oh, that thing looks sick as hell. Okay, that's cool. That's heckin' cool. Okay. Oh god, it's just a normal race. <laughs> Look at us. <laughs> Here we go. The gang. We're doing it. Oi. It's off.
What the fuck happened there? Hello? What the fuck was going on? Alright, we're doing good, we're doing good. Damn, they are so quick, though. I feel like we've got to make up for it in this next round. But is it just their, their vehicle is really quick? I'm not sure if I know the reasoning for what. That's, that's what we call karma. Thank you very much. No. Fuck's sake, game. Don't do this. It, no, it heard me. <laughs> yeah, fucking heard me. No, 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 no. Oh, <laughs> only just. Only just. We nearly got got at the end. We nearly got got. Oh my god. This game is so cool. So for fans of like Bloodborne and people that have played this, like this is ne this is all in order, right? This must all be in like order for when you tackle things in the game. Obviously, the story I'm getting like a very dry cut version of what's happening, but Nicholas, the name echoes in the hunter's mind. The angelic knowledge. That the mistress spoke of. Perhaps this Nicholas will unlock the answers uh, to this nightmare. On with his, uh, on with this information, the hunter begins their return journey to the city of Miralodia to find him. Although the trip will be fraught with danger, a friendly face soothes the nerves. Didn't know. <laughs> Nick Cage is in this game too. Yeah, yeah, Nick Cage actually features in most of the games we're playing. The Craptacular this year. And he's right here as well. He's with me in studio. Isn't that crazy? He's right next to me. Okay, we kind of have to take the cool looking motorcycle, right? I, I, I want to keep... No, we had to keep the moped game up. We had to, we had to keep the moped game. You kind of have to, what, for the... It's... Listen. I've committed to the moped now. I think we've got... We've got to be... We've got to be living that moped life now, I think. I think this is what we've... Toss a coin. Oh, shit. Okay, I'll do that for the next one. I'll do that for the next one. Who's the familiar face? Is it Patches? Oh. I know Patches. What do we have here? A hunter conscripted against their will. How amusing with that arm of yours. Trying to make your way back into Miralodia proper. Be warned. As the city sinks deeper into the darkest umbra of the night, the beast within will offer no quarter. But enough talk. Take this. You will not be able to re-enter without a proper fight. Oh. Angel Arena. Oh. Thanks for the warning. Team Bloodbath. Okay, we got a draw. Sure. The closest to ten wins, or whoever gets the ten first win. Oh god, it's us versus them. 
Can you see the werewolf dude? <laughs> I'm just going to drift around here. DK stands for Donkey Kong, Honky Dong. Drift King, true. I should have picked that up. We are the Drift King. Oh shit, okay. Right, where are they at? Two up, I think. I think we're red team. Two up. I think we got this. I think we got this. We're not going to get to 10, but... We'll definitely make a habit of beating them. Crazy. Where are they? I feel like one of this, one of them's just been stuck the whole time. I feel like we've been pretty good. It's because one of them's been like stuck for ages. This is a scene from Fast and Furious. Oh, okay. I've not. I've only watched like maybe the first. When was Tokyo Drift? Oh no, wait, no, I haven't. Or was that Fast and Furious? So I actually can't remember. I don't. I don't remember that much anyway. So <laughs> I don't remember it very well either way. Tokyo Drift is three. Okay, yeah, I don't remember that film then. It's even in the title. I probably should have picked up on that. <laughs> Drift King. All right, the hunter parts uh, ways with the raven and returns to central Merolodia as the darkness of the night seeps into every corner of the cursed city. The search for Nicholas will have to wait. There are beasts that need to be cold. The perfect job for a hunter. It 
Central Nickelodeon, yeah. Oh, I, I must have completely missed that. I know that Drift King's a thing, I just didn't associate it with Fast and Furious. Weird. I, I, the thing is, I'm pretty certain I've seen that one, so clearly I didn't like it. I need to be real, I don't like Fast and Furious movies, I'm not a big fan. But, I think... Oh, okay, this is kind of fucking cool. Okay, should we flip a coin? And that was brought up before. Where is coin? Alright, what are we saying? Same. Let fate design. Let design? Decide. Okay, if it's heads, we're going to continue being uh, motorbike gang. Oh, sorry, moped gang. If not, we're going to try out um, the, the wheel. Alright. I flipped it over with my hand. Okay. It's heads. Fuck. Okay. Well, we're gonna continue. We're gonna continue being moped gang then. Fuck. I wanted to try it out. God damn it. It's fate. Yeah. Fate decided. The coin toss is sacred. This is true. All right. Let's go to Central Nickelodeon. Man, when was it really 2010 those films started? That's crazy. The hunt. Four thousand blood okay, sure. We can do that. And and I have a team this time. My IT team. drop let's say not for long oh yeah we're on red I remember wait are we are we the baddies I think, I think we're on red, right? God, we've got so many droplets. Oh my god, I dropped the game. <laughs> oh, we won. Do we just get more? Was it first to 4,000? It was, wasn't it? Or 4,500. Well, we did it. That's all you do. You wait for them to collect them for you, and then you just kill the person who's got the most. That's how you do it. Also, they do look. It's, it's Del Boy and Rodney. Rodney, you plonker. Alright. I like that. I like that for the little, little moped bit. The hunter seeks out the ever helpful outsider whose knowledge of the cursed city could help them locate Nicholas. But the pain of his window is dark, and inside 
uh, inside his abode lurks abominations of the night. Tragic. All right. Yeah, we're, we're gonna stick to it. The, the the coin decided. The coin decided. Co coin toss number two. We could do another coin toss. I'm kind of tempted. All right. Okay. Okay. It's done. <laughs> it's fucking heads again. <laughs> Are you fucking serious? Fine. All right. It looks like we're, we're fucking sticking with the moped. It's fate. It is. It is fate. Outsiders Mansion. It's just a race, right? Yeah, we're all good. I love the giant pig thing, it's so funny. I'm off to catch some Zeds. Um, later, it's good luck with the races. Thank you so much, Jessica. Have a good evening, dude. Take it easy. I'll catch you again soon. Oh, is this map meant to be like Baby Park? Or it's just like one big loop that's like... I get Baby Park vibes from this a little bit. Have I lapped someone? Is that how well I'm doing? Have I lapped someone? that doing it I think, I think we're doing pretty well honestly all in all I feel like we're doing pretty good just like that we're already done hell yeah Let's go. After consulting the outsider's directions, oh, sorry, a directory, the hunter traveled to uh, Miradoria's, sorry, Miral, Miralodia's even, <laughs> Miralodia College, where Nicholas is said to dwell. What they find within may only raise more questions. Oh no. Match type is special. What does that mean? Right. Yeah, alright, we're gonna stick to the little moped that could, I think. We're committing to the bit at this point, I think we have to. I wonder how far in we are, I actually have no idea. As I say, I saw people with two hours in the game saying they finished it, so... Ah, yes. The Architect. The Architect. Do you not hear our pleas? There he is. We should not awaken from this nightmare. 
He's got a little burb on his head. Look at him. You cannot stop us. You cannot catch us. <laughs> Is there a... Oh, no. Is it going to be one of those missions? <laughs> Does he just run? Oh, that is so funny. Okay. Like we're already quite behind. You're waiting for me down here. Okay, so I can't go that way. There he is. I have no idea how we go about doing this, so I'm... Can I change the direction it goes in? Or maybe I can. Oh, I can, okay. That's a bit easier. Hi there. How you doing? Okay, he's just designed to try and stay behind you, isn't he? If you just do this. I wonder if there's a way of baiting him out. Okay, well that was...
Okay. I don't know how I would have found that on my own, but sure. Other than, um, what I mean is like, other than through like trial and error. He just waits behind me. Okay, well that went well. Way? Oh fuck. How much of that do I have to do again? Not the whole thing. Okay, cool. Thank you, game. Oh, I had a heart attack then. We got him. We got lucky then. A spam button. Spam buttons to win. The nightmare mustn't end. Oh no. Rest. Um, I think we're just falling to our deaths though. But we got Nicholas at least. We killed him. I don't know where we are, but <laughs> it's somewhere. Hey, there we are. <laughs> Good job. We did it. We nearly didn't make it though, like, we were so close to not making it. Having bested the Keeper of the Nightmare, the Hunter returns to the Misty Dream, seeking answers about the Architect and the beings that first initiated the Hunter, only to find preparations underway for the final race and the false reality that is the dream, uh, that is the dream begins to collapse. Okay. Well, and I like the bird cage. It's kind of funny. I feel like we kind of have to do the bird cage, right? Kind of the bit. Right, here we go. Ah, 
I have no idea what to expect, honestly. Oh, dream what is this? This looks insane. <laughs> this looks crazy. We play as Nicholas or the Hunter? I think we are just the Hunter, aren't we? So, this is it. This is so weird. This game is so weird. Yeah, I might be dead. Oh my god, are we in first? Oh, we are. Oh, we got to keep going. Jesus Christ. I think just hold on to this health pack and run. That's honestly all we can do. This game is so silly, I love it. Alright, final lap. Good, have we lapped them all on the final one? Let's go. Not lapped them, sorry, I think we just outrun them though. I think they're all fighting over there still, so I think we'll be alright. Because we're so far ahead. There we go. Bit of BM. A little bit of BM there on the finish line. Don't mind me.
Hell yeah. Is that it? Did we beat the game? As the night comes to a close, the hunter confronts Herman about the truth behind the dream and its architect. But the old man had something different in mind. Herman, alongside all the other participants, encouraged, uh, encountered during the dream, uh, gather for one final hunt, one final battle, where only one hunter will remain standing. Oh fuck, there's more? I thought that was going to be the last one. Oh shit, okay. Um, in that case, I think we have to do... We have to go back to our old reliable moped, right? It's done us this well. We'll, we'll go back to old reliable. Alright, let's go. Last hunter standing. Ah, fuck. This could be hard, isn't it? Oh, no. I try and just let them kill each other for a bit. Fuck it now. Maybe I'll wait for them to... Alright, Nicholas died. No, my boy. My boy. I like Nicholas. I think Nicholas is my favourite. We are very low on health, so I'm, I'm trying to be as careful as I can be. Is landing on the melee weapon. No. Fuck. We nearly had it. Okay. Alright, this is the one. We got, we got this, we got this. We got this. We got this. I honestly think just letting them fight it out might be a good shout. Nicholas died already. 
for the tragedy. Is Nicholas a bit of a meme character in... I'm going off of like what I saw just there. Oh yeah, we did it. Let's go. Hell yeah. Oh, that's great. That was a lot of fun. Yeah, the only level I found to be a pain was that one, like, capture the flag level. That was annoying as hell, but everything else? Hell yeah. That flaming cart we just saw as well, I think it was. Hunter, here we stand at the end of this nightmare. The denizens of the dream, with their silly customs, have attempted to use you to further their own selfish goals. But your role in this is greater than anything you could have imagined. Kind Hunter, I offer you freedom. Freedom from this nightmare. Do you accept? Oh. The truth has been revealed. The city of uh, Miralodia. I keep doing that. I pause every time I have to say it. Like, say it. Uh, the, the city of Miralodia. The race. The nightmare. It was all born from an ancient yearning, uh, yeah, yearning to make contact with angels, cosmic beings beyond our understanding. Now, at the end of this terrible dream, Onet offers to free, uh, free you from this nightmare. Do you accept? Sure, why not? Is that it? I wonder what happens if you say no. Do you have not having to like race them? Oh. Oh, okay. That's cool. That's cool. <laughs> He's still got his fucking car key in his hand. Is that somebody else? I actually don't know who that is. Is that just one of the people?
<laughs> well. That's Nightmare Cop. Hell yeah, that was great, honestly. And we beat it in two hours, pretty much on the dot. I'm well happy with that. That's great. That's really, really cool. Yeah, I, I don't really have anything else to say. I just really enjoyed that. Even as someone who's not played, like, Bloodborne, this game has been a genuine gem. Very cool. Um, again, the only issue I had was with the one level that was like Capture the Flag theme. I didn't really like that. Um, everything else though has been pretty pretty solid actually. Perfect timing, I know right? Perfect timing. Oh, there they are. There they are, there's the gang. They love it, look at them. Wow, imagine if Dark- <laughs> imagine if Bloodborne ended like this. <laughs> imagine if- <laughs> Imagine if Bloodborne ended and everyone was waving and smiling at the screen. I'm sure that's definitely what happens in the, uh, the From Software game. For sure. Okay. Sure, why not? Amazing, well, yeah, that's great timing. And it's New Game Plus, oh no, I can't do New Game Plus. I think just a one playthrough is okay. Anyway, amazing, thank you for watching today, guys. So, would you like me to reveal the game? Um, I will... Put the riddle in one more time for tomorrow's game. Right. Oh, so I've got a thing that says complete the tutorial, which I previously didn't have. That's interesting. Okay. So one more time with the riddle. Lycanthropy isn't for everyone, but especially not these two. And there's another kind of transformation the owner would go through. He has no craving for humans, pets, cheese, or meats. It's only prized veggies that this hulking mammal would see as a formidable feast. I think that last one's a bit too long, but you get the gist. That last bit. Do you have any last minute guesses, or would would people like me just to say? Because I'm very happy just to reveal it. Okay, I'm gonna... Oh, oh. Happy music. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Happy music. <laughs> I will find a video of said game. Actually, you know what? No, this game... This, I want this game to be a surprise, because I think it's going to be genuinely chaotic as fuck. Um, tomorrow's game, and potential series that we're going to do, is a Wallace and Gromit game. I still don't know. Okay, it's a Wallace and Gromit game. It's Curse of the Were-Rabbit for PS2. Because everybody really, really liked the Wallace and Gromit streams I did earlier in the year. I thought I would... I would repay the favor, and therefore we're gonna we're gonna play Curse of the Were Rabbit for PS2 tomorrow. Um, so yeah, stay tuned. We've got some Wallace and Gromit games on the way, or game, I should say. Um, I have no idea how good this game looks. I mean, I almost don't want to show it off because I don't want to spoil it. Let's have a look. Oh, good lord. I'd be feeling a great deal better if we had.
All right, I'm going to very quickly leave this on screen. Just as an idea for what we're dealing with tomorrow. Um, it's quite cursed in its own way. Look at, look at this. Look. Anyway, we'll be playing this tomorrow. Um, enjoy. Have a good evening. <laughs> I will see you tomorrow for Wallace and Gromit. This game looks interesting from what I've seen of it before as well. But I, as I say, I don't want to give it all away. So stay tuned. I will see you then. Have a great evening. Thank you, Jay Boogie, for being here as always. Thank you, Jess Kill. Thank you, Ranger. Thank you, KY. Thank you, Florbury. Thank you, Caleb. Thank you, anybody else that's popped by and lurked. I appreciate you. And yeah, I'll see you tomorrow for uh, a continuation of Wallace and Gromiting. I'll see you then. Oh, I've lagged out some. What? Hello? Bye.